Daniel Medvedev versus John Isner is the second semi-final for the Canadian Open for 2021. And both players have had to fight their way to get into the semi-final stage. John Isner started the tournament off, taking on another unseeded player for Kina in the first round. And after a close first set, Isner would get through in straight 6-4, 6-1. His second round opponent would be the 13th seed Garen. And although Garen is more of a clay court player, he pushed Isner to three, with the big American eventually prevailing 4-6, 6-3, 6-4. His third round opponent would be against top 10 player Andre Rublev, the number four seed at this event. And Isner looked very impressive against Rublev, who seemed to struggle with the Isner power, with Isner getting through in two tight sets, 7-5, 7-6. His quarterfinal opponent would be against the 11th seed and Frenchman, Gael Monfils. And after a very close first set, Isner ended up winning in straight sets, 7-6, 6-4. Medvedev came into this tournament as the number one seed and would get a bye in the first round. His second round opponent was against Bublik, a player that he's played a lot this year. And after Bublik won the first set, Medvedev was in a lot of trouble and seemed to be struggling mentally, but he pulled himself together, eventually prevailing in three sets, 4-6, 6-3, 6-4. His third round opponent was against the qualifier Duckworth, who had just come off beating Yannick Sinner in the second round. Medvedev was too good on this occasion, winning in straight sets, 6-2, 6-4. His quarterfinal opponent was against the seventh seed and Miami Open champion, Hubie Hercatch. And after getting destroyed in the first set, Medvedev hung on to eventually win in three, two, six, seven, six, seven, six. These two have only played the one time before. That was at the ATP Cup last year in 2020, with Medvedev getting the pretty easy straight sets win, three and one. If Isner's gonna get his first win against Medvedev, he's gonna have to serve well, and he's probably gonna have to win a couple of tie breaks. We saw that Medvedev played really well in the tie breaks against her catch, but Isner's gonna have to serve well and take the baseline away from Medvedev. Make Medvedev move and make him run around. If Medvedev's gonna win this one, he just needs to be patient. We know Isner's gonna serve aces. He knows that Isner's gonna hit big serves and push him around a lot and probably gonna get a lot of easy free points. Medvedev just needs to be patient and out rally Isner. We know Isner hasn't got the best movement, so so that's what he needs to do. He needs to make sure that Isner's on the run and he might get some chances to break if Isner does get tired. This is going to be an interesting one for me because Medvedev did beat Isner pretty easily in their only matchup, but against Hubie Hercatch, Medvedev looked a little bit shaky, hit a lot of errors as well. So I'm going to go with Medvedev, but it's going to be three sets, I reckon. A few tie breaks as well, just like we saw when he played against Hercatch. But let me know down in the comments below, who do you think is going to win this semifinal?